of the Hispanic culture. In some cases, the flavors are bold, and through these dishes, you get a taste of that culture. Uh, Fox 40's Monica DeAnda takes us to Sol Cubano, a restaurant in Sacramento that's sharing their Cuban culture through food. Welcome to Sol Cubano. We want customers to feel like they're in Cuba, like to experience what it is. This family-owned restaurant is bringing El Sabor de Cuba, a taste of Cuba, to Sacramento. Like the yuca frita, tostones, platos maduros. You're always going to eat your lechon, um, lechon asado. Tucked away in North Highland, this Cuban restaurant Se le pone la magia. brings the flavor to every dish. I uh, saw a lack of Cuban culture, like a, a representation of Cuban culture here in Sacramento. So we were like, what better place to, you know, share our foods and our cultures than through a restaurant? And the Lao family has been doing just that since 2009. Serving traditional Cuban dishes like rabo encendido, oxtail, served with moros y cristianos, Cuban rice and beans, and of course, the famous Cuban sandwich. Roasted pork, ham, pickles, mustard, Swiss cheese, all squished on a panini grill. Okay, let's give it a go. Have a little cute Cuban flag. We're about to experience some Cuban flavor here. Mm. Two thumbs up. But that's not the only delicacy that got five stars in my book. Lechon. Yeah, lechon for sure is my favorite so far. The croqueta is actually really good as well, but I don't know. I'm really into this. These family recipes span decades. My grandpa um, actually owned a restaurant back in Cuba as well, so it's kind of like not a tradition, but kind of a way to also keep his spirit alive as well. Keeping her grandpa's spirit alive, one Cuban dish at a time. Sharing cultures is like a beautiful thing. I think everyone should be able to experience different cultures. It makes us really happy that we can share our culture and our food. In Sacramento, Monica de Anda, Fox 40 News.